How's it going, everybody? Doing a channel update. Come join channel update and drink review here today. I'll do the update and then I'll jump into the drink review. We got a sun kissed strawberry lemonade here. I might have had this once, but I'm not sure. review in like maybe five or six minutes. Um, but yeah. The update is just kind of what I'm going to be doing next couple vids. I need to start getting into some of the requests. I do apologize for requests that don't get done. I've said this before. I probably say yes or maybe to too many requests. Or something, I end up not doing a bunch, so I do apologize for requests that haven't been done. Um, I do want to film the I want to do another shady tax man that was asked. I want to do that obviously before probably by April. That won't be done. I still got to film the uh, sports car. I 
I don't feel like I can, you know, get everything I want to get in. Because sometimes I start favoring certain things, and that's just how it goes with me. Some months I'm starting to favor video game related shit or drink reviews or reviews. I'm doing some maybe. In some months I do a couple more role plays, you know. I kind of just wing it. But if I start another channel, maybe I'd focus on kind of like the movie reviews. The game reviews get more gameplays on that channel as well, while still putting some up here also. But it's something I've thought about doing. I know other channels have done it. Sometimes it's good to kind of stretch out and put one focus or two focuses into another channel. So you're not adding it onto what you're already doing. Because that's the thing. I pull in all of a sudden people like to drink views. I start doing those. If I start pulling more movie reviews, I'm pulling more content into this channel. And then if I start leaning on it, all of a sudden other things, and it's kind of happened already, other things go to the back burner. But it's something I've thought about. It doesn't mean it's going to happen. I might, you know, if anybody interested in that, because I'd want a bigger sub base, because I'd want to pull subs from this channel over that one. People who like that content. So the more I have, the more chance, you know, I can pull subs earlier. Um, but we'll see on that. That wouldn't happen for a bit anyway, if it happened. Um, but if anybody wants that or be interested in that, let me know in the comments. I'll put a comment as well. But that's the channel update. Let's get into this uh, drink review here. This is the old uh, Sunkist. I don't know, I think I've had this or something. They have a few, they have a, a, a raspberry limeade, I think I saw. They have like a pineapple. <laughs> they, have, they actually have a decent amount of other flavors. It's got a good smell. Kind of interesting. The first swig I took, I was more lemonade-ish. The second one was more strawberry. <clears throat> it's not bad. Um, let's see what it has in it. Two hundred seventy calories a bottle. No caffeine. And this one, some weird. Some of the actually, I don't think any Sunkist has caffeine. Produced under the joint authority of Dr. Pepper 7-Up. I thought, I always thought Pepsi had some gifts. I guess not. But really, Dr. Pepper 7-Up have a little bit of a thing going. Um, this isn't too bad. not a strong taste at all <laughs> it's like weird i'm actually getting more of a blend further down the bottle but it's not much of a taste in there it's not strong at least <clears throat> it goes down easy enough there's no real strong aftertaste either This is probably like a 
six five or six. I don't know. It isn't bad. I don't know how much I've actually drank it though. I do want. To, I think it's a berry. Maybe it's just berry lemonade. I've seen it. It's in blue. It's blue, like voltage. Um, it's all right though. It's got the nice sun kiss logo. <laughs> It's not a strong taste, so it kind of just gets a little boring. It's making me burp plenty. I don't know, it's it's very light. It has a light taste to it. It's certainly not like strong, like I said, strong strawberry. I would expect it to be a little stronger. I think even on the lemonade side, actually, the strawberry is now more. If I had to say one was dominant, it would be the strawberry. And it's not even a strong strawberry, but it, I'm getting more of that. Yeah, uh, thanks for your 